Passion Travail is a chain specializing in everything related to travel, street food, and like subscribe if you like the content. Pelmeni, Pelmeni are small dumplings filled with a mixture of minced meat, usually pork, beef, or a combination, and spices. They are typically boiled or steamed and served with sour cream or butter. Pelmeni are a popular and beloved street food in Russia. They are small dumplings filled with a mixture of minced meat, typically a combination of beef and pork, along with onions, garlic, and various seasonings. To make pelmeni, a thin dough is rolled out and small circles are cut from it. A spoonful of the meat filling is then placed in the center of each dough circle. The edges of the dough are folded and pinched together to create a sealed dumpling, typically in a half moon or tortellini shape. Pelmeni are typically boiled in salted water until they float to the surface, indicating that they are cooked through. They are then served hot, often with a dollop of sour cream and a sprinkle of freshly ground black pepper. These dumplings can be enjoyed in various ways. Some people prefer to eat them as they are, savoring the combination of flavors from the meat filling in the tender dough. Others like to dip the pelmeni in sour cream, vinegar, soy sauce, or mustard for an extra kick of flavor. Pelmeni are a popular street food because they are delicious, satisfying, and convenient. They can be found in street food stalls, fast food restaurants, and even in frozen food sections of supermarkets throughout Russia. They are often served in large quantities, making them ideal for sharing with friends or family. Pelmeni are a comfort food that is enjoyed year-round in Russia. Whether it's a quick snack on the go or a hearty meal in a cozy cafe, these dumplings are a staple of Russian cuisine and a must-try street food for visitors and locals alike. Pirozhki, pirozhki are small baked or fried pastries filled with a variety of fillings, including meat, potatoes, cabbage, cheese, or fruit. They are a popular and portable snack in Russia. Pirozhki are a type of baked or fried pastry that is popular street food in Russia. They are small, handheld pastries filled with various savory or sweet fillings. The dough for pirozhki is typically made from wheat flour and yeast resulting in a soft and slightly flaky texture. The dough is rolled out and cut into small circles or squares, which are then filled with a variety of fillings. Savory pirozhki fillings often include ingredients such as ground meat, beef, pork, or a combination, cabbage, potatoes, mushrooms, onions, and herbs. These fillings are typically seasoned with salt, pepper, and other spices to enhance the flavors. Sweet pirozhki, on the other hand, are filled with ingredients such as sweetened cottage cheese. Fruit preserves, apples, berries, or a combination of fruits. They may also have a sweet glaze or powdered sugar sprinkled on top after baking. Once filled, the dough is sealed, often by pinching the edges together, creating a pocket for the filling. The piroshki are then baked in the oven or fried until they turn golden brown and develop a crisp outer crust. Piroshki can be found in street food stalls, bakeries, and cafes throughout Russia. They are a popular snack or quick meal option, enjoyed by both locals and tourists. Pirozhki are often served warm and can be eaten on the go or enjoyed with a cup of tea or coffee. These flavorful pastries offer a wide range of fillings, allowing for a variety of taste experiences. Whether you prefer savory or sweet flavors, Pirozhki are a delicious and convenient street food choice that showcases the culinary diversity of Russian cuisine. Shashlik, shashlik is a Russian version of skewered meat, similar to kebabs. It consists of marinated chunks of meat, typically pork or lamb, grilled over an open flame and served with bread or vegetables. Shashlik is a popular street food in Russia, originating from the Caucasus region. It refers to skewered and grilled meat, Similar to kebabs or barbecue, shashlik is typically made using chunks of marinated meat, commonly lamb, but other meats such as pork, beef, or chicken can also be used. The meat is typically seasoned with a marinade made from ingredients like vinegar, oil, onions, garlic, herbs, and spices. The marinated meat is then threaded onto skewers, traditionally made of metal or wooden sticks. The skewers are grilled over an open flame or on a barbecue allowing the meat to cook slowly and develop a smoky flavor. The cooking process results in tender and juicy pieces of meat with a slightly charred exterior. Shashlik is often enjoyed with various accompaniments. 
It is traditionally served with flatbread, such as lavash or pita, which can be used to wrap the grilled meat and create a flavorful sandwich. It is also commonly accompanied by fresh vegetables, such as tomatoes, onions, and cucumbers, as well as sauces like yogurt-based tzatziki or pomegranate sauce. Shashlik is not only a popular street food option but also a favorite dish for gatherings, picnics, and outdoor events in Russia. The aroma of sizzling shashlik on the grill is a familiar and enticing sight during summertime. The art of making shashlik is often passed down through generations, and different regions may have their own variations and marinade recipes. It is a beloved culinary tradition that showcases the flavors and techniques of Russian and Caucasus cuisine whether enjoyed at a street food market, a summer barbecue, or a traditional Caucasian restaurant, shashlik offers a delicious and satisfying meat dish that is enjoyed by many in Russia and beyond. Cerniki Cerniki are small pancakes made from cottage cheese or quark. They are usually sweetened and served with sour cream, jam, or honey. Cerniki are a popular breakfast or dessert option. Cerniki are delicious Russian pancakes made from quark cheese also known as farmer cheese or curd cheese, eggs, flour, and sugar. They are a popular breakfast or dessert dish in Russia and neighboring countries. To make cerniki, you'll need the following ingredients, 500 grams of cork cheese, farmer cheese or curd cheese, 2 eggs, 4 tablespoons of all-purpose flour, 2 tablespoons of sugar, or to taste, a pinch of salt, vegetable oil or butter for frying. Here's a step-by-step -step guide to making cerniki. In a mixing bowl, combine the cork cheese, eggs, flour, sugar, and salt. Mix well until all the ingredients are thoroughly combined and a thick batter is formed. Heat a nonstick skillet or frying pan over medium heat and add a small amount of vegetable oil or butter to coat the surface. Take a spoonful of the cerniki batter and drop it onto the heated skillet, shaping it into a pancake like round. Repeat with the remaining batter, leaving some space between each cerniki. Cook the cerniki for about 2 to 3 minutes on each side, or until they turn golden brown. Flip them gently using a spatula. Once cooked, transfer the cerniki to a serving plate. You can keep them warm in a preheated oven, set to a low temperature, while you cook the remaining batches. Serve the cerniki hot, traditionally with sour cream, honey, or your favorite fruit preserves. You can also sprinkle them with powdered sugar for an extra touch of sweetness. Cerniki are often enjoyed for breakfast or as a dessert. They have a slightly crispy exterior and a soft, creamy center. The combination of the tangy cork cheese and the sweetness from the sugar makes them absolutely delicious. Note, while the traditional recipe calls for cork cheese, you can also substitute it with other types of fresh cheese, such as ricotta or cottage cheese, if cork cheese is not readily available. Cabbage soup Shkai shkai is a traditional Russian cabbage soup made with sautéed cabbage, broth, and often includes vegetables, meat, or mushrooms. It is a hearty and comforting dish commonly found in Russian street food stalls. Cabbage soup is a hearty and nutritious dish made with cabbage, vegetables, and sometimes meat or broth. There are many variations of cabbage soup, but I'll provide you with a basic recipe that you can customize to your taste. Here's how to make cabbage soup, ingredients, 1 small head of cabbage, shredded, 2 carrots, diced, 2 stalks of celery, diced, 1 onion, diced, 3 cloves of garlic, minced, 4 cups of vegetable or chicken broth, 1 can, 14 ounces, of diced tomatoes, 1 bay leaf, 1 teaspoon of dried thyme, salt and pepper to taste, olive oil for cooking, optional, cooked meats such as diced chicken or sausage, instructions. Heat a large pot or Dutch oven over medium heat. Add some olive oil to coat the bottom of the pot. Add the diced onion and minced garlic to the pot. Saute until the onions become translucent and the garlic is fragrant, about 2 to 3 minutes. Add the diced carrots and celery to the pot. Cook for another 3 to 4 minutes, stirring occasionally. Add the shredded cabbage to the pot. Stir and cook for a few minutes until the cabbage starts to wilt. Pour in the vegetable or chicken broth and diced tomatoes, including the juice from the can. Stir well to combine, add the bay leaf, dried thyme, salt, and pepper to the pot. If you're using cooked meat, such as diced chicken or sausage, add it at this point, bring the soup to a boil, then reduce the heat to low. 
cover the pot and let the soup simmer for about 30 to 40 minutes. Or until the cabbage and vegetables are tender, taste the soup and adjust the seasoning with more salt and pepper if needed. Remove the bay leaf before serving, ladle the cabbage soup into bowls and serve hot. You can enjoy it as is or accompany it with crusty bread or a side salad. Cabbage soup is a versatile dish, and you can add other vegetables or spices to suit your preference. Some variations include adding potatoes, beans, or herbs like parsley or dill. Feel free to experiment and make it your own.